We begin with developing news. We have new details on what police are calling another ambush attack on a sheriff's deputy. This time it happened in San Luis Obispo County. Authorities say that the deputy was shot in the head by a gunman intent on harming or killing police. All started when a man began firing at the Paso Robles police station early this morning. As the deputy responded to the scene, he was shot in the head, and that sparked an intense manhunt for the shooter. Hours later, another man was found dead near the city's Amtrak station, also shot at close range. It's believed both shootings are related. The sheriff described how his deputies took fire. The two deputies were searching the area in which the shooter was last seen. They were out of their vehicle and came under fire. This was an ambush that he planned it. Um, he intended for uh, officers to come out of the police department and to assault them. Within the past hour, authorities releasing these images of the suspected shooter. Now, they do believe he has left the area. And at last word, that deputy was in serious condition. Well, today's shooting comes just days after another ambush attack left a Santa Cruz County deputy dead. On Saturday, Sergeant Damon Gutzweiler was killed after responding to a call about guns and explosives inside a white van. The suspect arrested was an active duty Air Force sergeant. The sheriff in San Luis Obispo County says there's nothing to link the two cases except, as he noted, the unprovoked attack on law enforcement.